कॉलेज लाइब्रेरी डेली करंट अफेयर्स न्यूज अपडेट 15 अक्टूबर 2023। पीएम इनोग्रेट्स 141 सेशन ऑफ इंटरनेशनल ओलंपिक कमेटी सेज इंडिया इज ईगर टू ऑर्गेनाइज ओलंपिक्स इन कंट्री G20 Parliamentary Speaker Summit concludes successfully in New Delhi. Indian Coast Guard conducts medical evacuation of Chinese crew on board Panama flagged vessel off Mumbai coast. Lok Sabha Speaker Om Birla registers protest against bringing proposal in European Parliament on India's internal issues. CBI conducts raids in various parts of West Bengal on allegations of passport forgery. Road Transport and Highways Ministry takes up campaign for Vivad Se Vishwas to settle all eligible claims. Government declares 23rd August as National Space Day to commemorate success of Chandrayaan 3 mission. PM Modi congratulates Ronak Sadhwani on his victory at 5 World Junior Rapid Chess Championship. Army Commanders Conference to be held in Delhi from October 16th to 20th. Lok Sabha Speaker Om Birla hands over P20 presidency to Parliament of Brazil. Second flight under operation Ajay lands in New Delhi with 235 stranded Indian nationals from Israel. India and Sri Lanka resume ferry service after 40 years. Health Minister Dr. Mansukh Mandviya inaugurates Nagaland's first medical college in Kohima. Commerce and Industry Minister Piyush Goyal released a compendium of PM Gati Shakti in New Delhi yesterday to mark the completion of 2 years of PM Gati Shakti. Maiden ferry flag off from Nagpattinam arrived at Kankesanthurai Harbour in Jaffna today. CDS General Anil Chauhan says national security strategy of India is evolving to suit character of modern warfare. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has conveyed his greetings on the auspicious occasion of Mahalia. PM Narendra Modi thanked artists Dhvani Bhanushali, Tanishk Bagchi and team of Just Music for musical rendition of Garba. PM Narendra Modi says terrorism in any form anywhere and for any reason is against humanity. Department of Water Resources, River Development and Ganga Rejuvenation launches fifth National Water Awards 2023. Principal Secretary to PM Dr. P K Mishra chairs high level task force meeting on air pollution in Delhi and Sia. Australia rejects proposal to recognize indigenous people in its constitution. Israel claims to have killed two Hamas commanders behind last week's deadly attacks on its southern territory. Christopher Luxon wins New Zealand election after incumbent PM Chris Hitchens concedes. Mahalia is being celebrated across India as an invocation to Goddess Durga for the beginning of Durga Puja. The formal period of Durga Puja running into 10 days starts the day after Mahalia. Israeli authorities target Hamas elaborate global crypto financial network. Saudi Arabia suspends talks on potentially normalizing ties with Israel. US Secretary of State Antony Blinken says Israeli actions are not retaliation but defending lives of its people. Israel ground forces raid into Gaza to locate 120 missing Israeli hostages. Russia proposes draft UNSC resolution on Israel-Hamas conflict. US law enforcement agencies stepped up security measures to safeguard Jewish and Muslim communities. French police disperses ban for Palestine rally in Paris amid Israel-Hamas conflict. US Secretary of State Antony Blinken meets with Palestinian Authority President Mahmoud Abbas in Jordan. In the ICC Men's Cricket World Cup, India have thrashed Pakistan by 7 wickets at Ahmedabad. PM Sports Minister congratulate Indian cricket team on victory against Pakistan in World Cup match. Arctic Open PV Sindhu loses to Wangs Hee in semi-final. Chief Minister Hemant Soren today unveiled the mascot jewelry and the trophy of Asian Women's Hockey Championship in Rajiv.